What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back with another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we are going over the market as per usual. Um, guys, I think there's gonna be a market crash. So, guys, if you are new, make sure to like it up, sub it up. It'd be appreciated. Let's hit 50 likes in the video, first two hours. 50 likes, first two hours. Huge giveaway, period. Huge empty giveaway if we hit that like goal. Um, so here's one snipe filter that I actually just witnessed, and it is Trailblazers Heat Check. Why is it such a good filter? Well, um, you could get 200 XP by simply winning a game with these cards. And yes, guys, if you didn't see the Luka gameplay, make sure to watch it, man. We got also follow the new channel. Sub to the new channel, man. We're doing sports cards. We got a sick video dropping. A sick video. We pulled a downtown insert in Panini Prism Draft. Um, but yeah, pretty much here it is. Win the game with um, using three Trailblazers heat check cards. Easy money. So I'm trying to snipe out those. That's an easy MT. And then we got this. this is also a good sniping filter right here. And we pulled Luca. We did the challenge. We sold him for a quick 100K. I didn't want to put him up for a bid. I don't want to get screwed. So I just threw him up for 100K. He probably goes for like 50K more. But realistically, I don't want to take the L. So I just sold him off quick. Um, but anyways, here we go, guys. Um, let's talk about the market. I think there's going to be a market crash. Uh, let's go over some cards. Let's see what's going on. Let's see if the market's down. Let's see if the market's up. So um, right off the bat, like I said, I have Hall of Fame clamps sitting in my collection. So I'm thinking about... Selling my Larry Bird with Hall of Fame clamps since he is Pretty sick if I add Hall of Fame clamps to him. I think his price will go up even more uh, That's pretty much a great way to make MT but like I'm saying right now uh, right now to make MT I think the most consistent filter is definitely gonna be Trailblazers heat check man There's so many good Trailblazers heat check player Well, there's not really good heat check players But a lot of snipes are going up on this filter as you can see right when I start off the video I got a Derek Jones jr. For 5 200 he's probably selling for around 7,000 MT so uh, this filter is pretty solid uh, Not only that you can do the challenges quick sell them off maybe make MT if you do snipe out the card So in my opinion man this filter right here Pretty good filter also if you have any heat check trailblazers make sure to sell them um, pretty interesting stuff. So, um, definitely try out this filter. Now, let's go over some snipe filters. Let's talk about the market a little bit, man. I know you guys are goats if you're watching this video. So, Pink Dynasty Center. And also, if you need to buy or sell your MT, hit me up on Xbox. I mean, hit me up on Instagram or Twitter. I'm buying and selling MT. And also, if you need any grinding done, make sure to hit me up. I grind challenges for you guys. Let me know. Um, hit me up on Instagram or Twitter. But, uh, here we go, man. Pink Dynasty Central minimum buyout guys if anything pops up you just want to buy it. there's so many good players on this filter and there is also small four pink down easter now i think there's going to be a market crash i don't know why i just have a feeling i'm thinking another opaline pack it is friday maybe the new idols i'm not sure but um definitely 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 oh small four pink down is ruined that's pretty interesting stuff right there so small four pink down is now ruined um the filter is no longer eligible to be goaded um, actually, Dominique Wilkins is the only player up here. So, small four pink down Eastern. Still a good filter. You want to buy everybody besides Neek and John Havlicek. Those are going to be the cards you want to look for. So, uh, definitely, definitely try out this filter. Maybe you can even snipe out of Dominique for cheap. So, try it out. You never know what's happening. I am on current gen right now because I figured out that current gen grinding is 15 times easier than next gen grinding. Like, it's literally not even in debate. Next gen grinding is literally so much harder. So I switched to current gen. Um, I'm on my next gen console, but you could run current gen on next gen. Um, but this filter is literally sick. You just have to get lucky. You have to get lucky with any snipe filter. You got to get lucky. And honestly, let's go over to Lucas snipe filter, man. Let's check it out. Let's see what's going on. See what's going on. See if it's active. See if he's a buyout. See whatever. Uh, so Luca dodges six minutes left, 180. So uh, yeah, it looks like he's definitely going to go to a buyout. So it looks like I'm not really going to lose MT. Uh, if you guys are watching this video and you did pull him, make sure to try to sell him ASAP because people are going to do his challenge and put him up right for a buyout. Um, this filter, if you get him for maybe 90k or less, maybe you'll get a little quick snipe. You make some good MT. That's probably my method. I would not buy this card for 100k or more. It's just not worth it. Just don't risk it. It's just not worth it. Now, market crash is coming. What should you guys do? Should you sell your cards? Should you hold your cards? Well, honestly, guys, the market is actually kind of down right now because we are in a new season. All the old season cards are literally so, so cheap. Like Larry Bird is so cheap. I'm pro I don't want to sell Larry Bird, 
But I have the Hall of Fame clamps on him. Get a mad MT for it. He might sell for like 300k. So I'm most likely going to add Hall of Fame clamps to Bird. And um, add some other badges. Make some MT. Right now, man, I feel like it is a good time to sell your cards. I don't see the market rising that much. I think there is only going to be a giant, giant, giant crash tomorrow. Depending on what they drop. If they drop idols, most likely not a crash. Um, so we'll see. Also, love. I love how they implemented. I love how they implemented Moments cards. Shout out to 2K for finally dropping Moments cards. They're literally goats for that. The content has literally been insane. And here's another snipe filter, man. My man, Walker, right here. He is a great snipe filter. It's crazy how I pulled Luca over Walker. It's crazy. But Walker, man, this filter is going to go crazy. It's super active. You just got to be patient when you snipe. I say you could get a ton of snipes on this filter for 14k or less easily. Knock out the challenge, throw him up on the auction. This price will drop. He's out for a couple days, man. Try to get some snipes on this filter. Definitely recommend it. Next filter we got for you is Amethyst Cheapest, man. It's still going crazy, man. These Amethysts did rise up a little bit. Unfortunately, man, the Hedo investments were not going to make a lot of MT. They dropped double take on like almost every single board, whether it's TTO offline, online, unlimited. They're literally all over the place. So looks like our Amethyst investments are not going to be as good as I expected. You should literally just sell off every single Amethyst you did get. Unfortunately, man, my prediction was pretty good. They did go up a little bit, but they had to just drop them. They had to drop them in TTO, both triple threads. So it's kind of an L, but other than that, man, this filter should go pretty good. It should go crazy. You might even get a Nikhil Walker on here. So it's a pretty interesting filter. Depends what does pop up. I say any shooters, any guys that could shoot threes. Oh, that's a really good one. Look at that. Glenn Davis for 2,100. I don't even know what he's going for, but I think that's a pretty, uh, nothing crazy. We're going to make a decent amount of MT. So I'll take that. Quick little 2K snipe right there. He's probably going to sell for around 30 something hundred. We'll make like a thousand MT. You can make a thousand MT every minute. That's 60K at the end of the day. So 60K per hour on this filter seems pretty good to me. And um, really, guys, that's really all we got for the video. Second video today. We also stream today. So if you guys are new, subs will be appreciated. Likes will be appreciated, man. We're on the grind for Kawhi Leonard. We're very behind, but we will get there. Anyways, boys, hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more content as per usual. Have a good one, boys. Peace.